Hey guys, 22 Plinkster here. I have been so busy here lately making videos and you know working and everything else that I have not taken the time to do something that I enjoy doing more than anything in this world. And of course, that is smallmouth bass fishing. Uh, today I am meeting up with my buddy um, up here and we're going to get in our kayaks and go down to the Red River near the Kentucky Tennessee state line and try to catch a few smallmouth bass. So it's kind of cloudy out here today, um, you know, overcast. We're supposed to get a little little bit of rain. We got the remnants of Hurricane Isaac coming in, so hopefully it don't wash us out. So I love to smallmouth bass fish. I know a lot of you out there are just shooters and not fishermen, so if you want to go ahead and turn this video off, you can now. But as for me, I'm headed to the river. All right, we're all loaded up with the kayaks. It's my buddy Eric. Say hello, Eric. Hello, Eric. All right, let's go catch some smallmouth. All right, we're ready to go. We got our kayaks loaded down. This is what we're gonna be using today. This is a Strike King watermelon copper crawl with the eighth ounce um, tender tube jig head. And of course there's the river. It's a little muddy today. It's not up, it's just a little muddy. But I believe we can catch us a smallmouth. We got our setup here, got the cooler full of Dr. Pepper and a peanut butter sandwich. Let's go catch some fish, Eric. It's about time. Oh, he's a nice one. Really? Really? Oh. Really? Alright. There's my first small mouth of the day. It's not real big. Nothing like what Eric had on while it goes, but pretty little fish. A little skinny though. Alright, second fish of the day. They're not getting bigger, they're getting smaller. Cows in the background back there. Pretty little fish. It's Tennessee smallmouth right there. Take him back. Alright, I promised you bigger smallmouth. That is a bigger smallmouth. It's a solid two pound smallmouth. Pretty, pretty fish. Caught it right over there in that eddy. Let's go back over and see if we can catch another. Alright. There's the biggest one yet. It's about a two and a half to three pounder. You can't get them all in the camera. <laughs> Pretty fish. Good healthy fish. Wearing them out today. Eat more chicken. This is a beautiful river guys. Red River. We got bluff over here. We got fields over here. It's just a beautiful river. There's really no place in this world I'd rather be than fishing for smallmouth on a river somewhere. Alright, here's the biggest one today. Uh, so far, we've only been fishing about 45 minutes. It's good two and a half, maybe three pound smallmouth. 
Man, he's pretty. She's pretty. Good fish. Alright, enough of this camera work. Let's go catch some more. Alright, we had a pretty good day today. Uh, we caught probably about, what, 10, 15 fish or so? Yep. Uh, these are the three of the biggest uh, smallmouth we caught. They go between two and three pounds. So, it was a pretty good day to be on the Red River. Sure beats a good day of work any day of the week. It's the last one we caught. Pretty good fish. Beautiful fish. Alright. Swim off. Oh yeah. Oh. Get bigger. This is the biggest one. Caught this one about an hour after we got on the water. Good, good fish. Alright, take this swim off. There you go. There you go. He'll make it. This one's still good and lively. This is the first big one we caught. Pretty good fish. Too pretty to eat. I like eating fish, don't get me wrong. But Old smallmouth like this, I like letting them go. Catch them again some other time.